previously on Undertale. Oh, a big sign that says core. F***ing ma- I knew it! Real drama, real action, real bloodshed! Oh, yes. Oh, oh yes. Oh my gosh, another goodbye. My heart can't handle it. I'm gonna be the good person, not gonna kill Asgore. We're gonna talk this out, and then I'm still gonna get to leave the underground. Now for the conclusion of Undertale. This does not look like the underground. Wow, the underground is massive. Is this where I was traveling in? So there's a lot of monsters in there, or is it just an empty f***ing kingdom? What if Asgore turns out to be like a super nice guy? <laughs> just keep walking, just keep walking. Oh, where am I? Safe here too. New home? New home? For all time's sake, go mama! <laughs> <laughs> Wait, this is Toriel's house! Oh my god. What have I done? This is where Toriel read a book to me. <laughs> it's a great reading chair, but it doesn't seem like anyone uses it. That's the chair that Toriel is sitting in! <laughs> oh my god. A long time ago, a human fell into the ruins. Injured by the fall the human called out for help. Okay. Ah, a key. I found a key. You took the key and put it on your phone's keychain. And it's a trash can. It's full of crumpled up recipes for butterscotch pie. Oh, why are you doing this to my heart? Asriel, the king's son, heard the human's call. He brought the human back to the castle. That's the, probably what we need to go see that's locked, but. This was my room! Oh, oh, why are there presents here? There's a heart-shaped locket inside the box. Yes, I'll take it. You got the heart-shaped locket. Heart locket, armor defense 15. Okay, yeah, best friends forever. We're gonna use that thing. There's a worn dagger. Is Okay, these are two opposites, polar opposites, but I'll take it. Yes, 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 I will. I don't know whose bed that is, but I don't share rooms, so. This is so sad. Uh, room under renovations. It's probably because it's Toriel's room. <laughs> okay, these are all the freaking monsters I ever fought in this game. Over time, Azriel and the human became like siblings. The king and queen treated the human child as their own. The underground was full of hope. This is gonna be some sad, inspiring shit right now. All right, took another key. Despite everything, it's still you. <laughs> oh my god, this game like makes you feel every emotion. How odd that the only things colored in this whole place are these flowers. I'm so sad. <laughs> this is about to be over. All right, this is how we got to the rest of the underground place, so. Then, one day, the human became very ill. Oh. And then what happened? The sick human had only one request, to see the flowers from their village. But there was nothing we could do. Oh, that's what the yellow flowers are. The next day, the next day, the human died. The music is getting real touchy. Asriel. Right. Racked with grief, absorbed the human soul. He transformed into a being with incredible power. The human soul, as we all crossed through the barrier, he carried the human's body into the sunset. Oh my god, this is so sad. Back to the village of the humans. This is heartbreaking. Asriel reached the center of the village. There, he found a bed of golden flowers. He carried the human onto it. Suddenly, screams rang out. The villagers saw Azriel holding the human's body. They thought he had killed the child. The humans attacked him with everything they had. He struck with blow after blow. Azriel had the power to destroy them all. But Azriel did not fight back. Clutching the human, Azriel smiled and walked away. It's kind of psychotic. Just getting your ass kicked, so you're just smiling and walking away. This is like trying to make me not want to kill kill Asgore, but I'm gonna kill Asgore. Wounded, Asriel stumbled home. He entered the castle and collapsed. His dust spread across the garden. The kingdom fell into despair. 
The king and queen had lost two children in one night. Oh. The humans had once again taken everything from us. The humans are pieces of shit. Honestly, we're awful. The king decided it was time to end our suffering. Every human who falls down here must die. With enough souls, we can shatter the barrier forever. King Asgore will let us go. King Asgore will give us hope. King Asgore will save us all. Now that he's dead. <laughs> you should be smiling too. Aren't you excited? Aren't you happy? I don't want to die still. Like, I feel really bad for all of them, but I still don't want to die. But I have to die. My boy. You're going to be free. Free how? Well, we'll see. I'm in the shadows, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna go into the light, and then I'm gonna be a monster. All right, we're getting close, I can feel it. What, what just happened? Sans? Is this Sans, Sans? So you finally made it. The end of your journey is at hand. In a few moments, you'll meet the king. Together? You will determine the future of this world. That's then. Now, you will be judged. You will be judged for the XP you've earned. Oh, what's XP? It's an acronym. It stands for Execution Points RIP! A way of quantifying the pain you have inflicted on others. Well, I have inflicted a lot of pain. When you have enough ex execution points, your love increases! Love, too, is an acronym. It stands for level of violence. Of course they tell you this at the end of the game. A way of measuring someone's capacity to hurt. I have, I have, ooh. The more you kill, the easier it becomes to distance yourself. I have crazy high ex love, I'm pretty sure. I just killed everybody. Now you understand it's time to begin your judgment. Oh my gosh. And considering what you've done, what will you do now? Take a moment to think about this. This is so stressful! rip. I'm a bad person. I'm thinking I'm gonna kill Asgore still. I'm sorry. Truthfully, it doesn't really matter what you said. All that's important is that you were honest with yourself. What happens now? We leave up to you. Oh my gosh. Now I understand acting and self-defense. You were thrown into those situations against your will. But isn't it your responsibility to do the right thing? Yeah. Kill. <laughs> ah. I see. Then why'd you kill my brother? They were gonna get in a fight there, but it's all, it's all good. No matter the struggles or hardships you faced, you strive to do the right thing. You refuse to hurt anyone. You never gained love, but you gained love. We're all counting on you, kid. Good luck. Thanks, buddy. I didn't expect this game to f with me that much. <laughs> I can't. I'm gonna cry. Let's fight. <gasps> the bed. The bed of flowers. Dum dee dum. <laughs> oh, is someone there? Dum dee dum. Howdy. How can I? He looks like like a boy version of Goat Mama. Asgore and Toriel make Asriel. Oh, f oh, I feel. Oh, they're really gonna make you feel bad about killing Toriel. I am an awful human being. Nice day today, huh? Birds are singing, flowers are blooming. <laughs> Perfect weather for a game of catch. You know what we must do. When you are ready, come into the next room. I'm not ready, bro. I'm not ready. I'm about to just look at everything in here, take my time. I'm really not ready for this. It's a throne. Yes, it is. It's another throne covered by a white sheet. Oh, the queen. <gasps> Toriel is the queen! Oh my god! My heart is so broken! How tense. <laughs> Just think of it like a visit to the dentist. <gasps> this is painful. Are you ready? I am not ready either. Then don't! Don't do it! Let's go. <gasps> okay, this is awesome. This is the barrier. Oh my word. Ready? What is that? That one's for me. Because my heart's ringing. It seems your journey is finally over. You're filled with determination.
determination. There's that determination I was looking for. Goodbye. Oh my god. What the frick? Stop! No! My mercy button! Holy sh! This is fucking sick! I said I didn't want to fight him. Like, that was his whole thing, and I said that I was gonna show redemption for Torio and like not even hurt him, but now he got rid of my option to even show him mercy. So I have to either fight or be killed. Let's just talk, bro. But there was nothing to say. Ah uh ha. -huh. See, this was like the same thing with Torio, where it was like when you tried talking to her, there was nothing. You firmly tell Asgore to stop fighting. Recollection flashes in his eyes. Asgore's attack dropped. Asgore's defense dropped. Whoa! Oh! Oh! Oh, it, it didn't kill me, huh? Because it was orange. The swipes were orange, so you had to move while it's orange. There's nothing to say. Asgore, talk to me! Ew, we're so dead. Oh, man. I am, I am getting messed up. This is not gonna go well. Let me recover. <laughs> Starfate. Seems talking won't do any more good. Up, oh, damn it. That way. That way. Okay. That one was not that bad. He's not saying anything. He's not taunting me. Blue. Oh, dang it. He blinks the eyes. I, was, I wasn't paying attention enough. Oh, it's blue, so I don't move. You don't want to fight him. But there's nothing else I can do. Except die. I really like, I want to redeem myself. I don't want to hurt him. This might be the like, tutorial fight where like as soon as I get really low health, it'll just let me win. You're gonna die. Unless this gets significantly easier somehow. Yeah, I mean, I died, but like, am I supposed to survive through that? I'm, yep, there it is. I died. <laughs> I was just, I was curious. Not at now, Brando stay determined. I guess I'm gonna have to like fight my way out of this. Acting didn't do anything since he took away our mercy option, so I really do have to fight him, and it's kind of bumming me out. Cause then I've killed Toriel and Asgore now. I can't do anything else. If dying just kills me, it doesn't progress my story. Well, that means I have to just I have to just fight him. Go straight for the attack. Fine. Attack. This is so sad to me. Well, if he dies, then, I mean, he's with his family. That sounds very morbid, but I don't know how to say it. It's like he really reluctantly doesn't, he does not want to fight me very clearly because his head's down the entire time. Come on. Asgore, let's just stop this. We're already, like, I'm halfway done with this HP, and I'm still super upset about this. We got this, we got this, we got this. We got this, we got this. We got this. Oh man, these are quick. That's right, we're gonna get it! And then that way! And then that way, and then that way. Okay, that one wasn't that bad. Asgore has low HP, yes, we know that. We can do this, we can do this. Blue, blue, blue. Dude, just give up! I don't want to kill you! And this is my last item, so I need to kill Asgore right away. Watch, this is gonna be the f time I'm gonna die right now, as he's like almost dead. Yes! <laughs> what if he has like a special? Oh! can't be it. That was too easy of a boss battle. I mean, I died once, but still, that was way too easy. I was really scared I was gonna kill him. F I didn't kill him, but I made him weaker. So that is how it is. I'm so sorry. I remember the day after my son died. Oh, waterworks. Don't tell me the story, man. The entire underground was devoid of hope. The future had once again been taken from us by the humans. In a fit of anger, I declared war. I said that I would destroy any human that came here. I would use their souls to become godlike. Then I would destroy humanity and let monsters rule the surface in peace. My wife, however, became disgusted with my actions. 
Oh, no. She left this place never to be seen again. I do not want power. I do not want to hurt anyone. See, that's the impression that I got. Look, he's a gentle being, but he has to do what he has to do. I just wanted everyone to have hope. I cannot take this any longer. I just want to see my wife. Oh my God, it better not give me the option to tell him the truth because I am not, I'm not a liar. I hate liars, but <laughs> I just want to see my child. Please, young one, this war has gone on long enough. You have the power. Take my soul and leave this cursed place. Uh, the ultimate decision. Oh, hold on. My ears. Oh my God. What? Do I have to choose? Now's the time I'd pause the game and Google both options to see what would best suit me. I just wanted the best for first people, but I won't be able to go home. I'm gonna kill them. Maybe I will become godlike and be able to split the barrier myself. Who knows? Probably not but it'll make me feel better going into it, making, you know, believe in that maybe. So, sad boy. Oh. I'm gonna give him mercy. This kingdom needs him. A kingdom needs a king, and it's not gonna be me. I can't fight him. I had to. That's my way, man. After everything I have done to hurt you, you would rather stay down here and suffer. Human. I promise you, for as long as you remain here, my wife and I will take care of you as best we can. Oh my god. God damn it, I killed her by accident. I'm so sorry. We can sit in the living room telling stories, eating butterscotch pie. We could be like a family. What the? Oh no. I remember those. I f knew it! You stupid flower bitch! That f flower! Bro, I want to kill this flower so bad! It's it's the flower. He he he. So you finally get it. In this world, it's kill or be killed. F Flowey? What happened? My scream just went out. I know. Oh. The screen just cut out all of a sudden. Is there no, go to the bottom. Go, go back to the game. All right, uh, hang on, that's weird. Um, hang on, we're gonna try to relaunch the game. Hold on. Did it just close? Did it just quit? Was this part of the game? Uh-oh. One day they all disappeared without a trace. Shoot. It froze bad. Oh. Can you? Level 9,999, my world. I thought I was gonna start from the beginning and then it just, this is so creative. Flower, you're about to get marked, you bitch! This is part of the game. Oh, God, wow. Oh my God. I'm like nervous. Like I'm about to get the nervous shits right now. What? <laughs> Jesus Christ, man! What the f are you doing? F you! Oh my God! Howdy. You really did a number on that old fool. If I'm gonna kill anyone, it's gonna be Flowey. Without you, I never could have gotten past him. But now, with your help, he's dead, and I've got the human souls. Boy, I've been empty for so long. It feels great to have a soul inside me again. You're feeling left out, aren't you? Well, that's just perfect. After all, I only have six souls. I still need one more before I become God. Oh, and forget about escaping your old save file. It's gone forever. This is too meta. This has become like, <laughs> they're breaking a major fourth wall here. But don't worry. I'll save over your own death. So you can watch me tear you to bloody pieces over and over and over. Jesus Christ! You really are an idiot. Okay, you bitch! Hands up, let's go! <laughs> what? 
This is, I think, seriously becoming my favorite game. This is so insane, and I love it. Look at all these plants. Oh, I can't move. Look at TV. Ew. Ew. Oh, this is. What the f is that? What? This is a total change in graphics. That's totally one of like the game maker's eyes right there or something. Oh my, oh what? Oh my, what? Oh my god. Wait, what is this? I'm just gonna die. I'm just gonna straight up die. What the, what the? Well, I'm just hide, fight, I'll fight. He's murked me, what the f Okay, so I did a little damage on him. That, that has to be impossible. There's no, there's no way that's possible. Flowey, this is all just a bad dream. And you are never waking up. <laughs> My God. <laughs> and it just, it just cuts it out again? It shut down again! Flowey, let me f***ing kill you! Did it just quit again? What? Also, did you purposely notice on our screensaver there's tiny little flowies? Is that on purpose? This is hurting my soul. I never felt a soul until I played this game. Hee hee hee. Did you really think I was gonna be satisfied killing you only one time? Jesus. Here it goes again, okay. <laughs> there has to be a way. There has to be a way. I thought I was done. What the is weird, man. Is that file saved? Can I just hide behind the arm? Fight, fight, fight. This whole sequence though reminds me of like those indie games, like the MLG type of games. Oh, oh, something different. Oh my God. What is this now? I didn't know I, oh, we can act. Okay, let's try. You called for help. And then? Oh. Uh -oh. <laughs> oh my God, one of the humans are giving me Oh, oh god, oh, oh, oh my, oh my, oh my god. Ah! Ah! Why, what, okay, fight, 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 fight. I got rid of five this time. Human, help! This is insane. This is insane. Please help. Help me! You called for help. Help me somebody, please. They're green, they're green, they're green. Oh, thumbs up. Give it all to me. Oh, no, no! Ah, file saved! Okay, it's saved, it's saved. Come on, we're really getting somewhere. I don't want to die again. Go. Oh. oh, yes. Oh. So, are they fighting from the inside? That's pretty dope. Whoa, I wonder if I can just... Okay. Stay down here, I think is the trick of this. Got it. Okay, okay. Oh, damn. Ah, 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 ah. You called for help. Come on, help come faster. Ah, yes. Okay. Get all them, get all them. Thank you. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Lies! Oh, my God. I'm going to be pissed if I don't make it out alive out of this. Now, this is a f boss battle I was hoping for. Please, please. Ooh, tapes. Ruin, trap, murder, doom. Nightmare, despair, slaughter. Act! You called for help. Turn green, turn green. Oh, calm, love. Success, love. Give me help, give me help. Not enough help! <laughs> Back into the fray. And... Insanity. Ah! Warning. Yes, please. I need your help. Oh. Okay. Oh, Frank Manson. Oh, well. oh, there you are, there you are. You called for help. Okay, so this is the fifth time, I believe? Green eggs. That's what they are. Back at it again. <laughs> I thought like different parts of this game were so intense, but I wasn't prepared for this. Nukes, dude! I love this like art theme. It's crazy. Here's the yellow heart. Is this a representation of what the human soul is? Greedy and green and disgusting and, and war driven? Oh, it's a gun. <laughs> hey, act. Call for help. Yes, give me love, give me love, give me love. What's happening? I got all of them. 
I got him. All the hearts have helped me. All the souls have helped me. Hey, guys. Thank you so much for everything you have done for me. Hope. Happiness. Oh, hope and band-aids and thumbs up. They're giving me support. Wow, this is legit. How beautiful is this? Lowey's defense dropped to zero. Attack, attack. I'm just about to kill him and grab everything I see that's green. You're gonna get your just desserts, you hear me, you little flower bitch. Oh my gosh. What is going on? I'm past the halfway point, guys. I'm proud of myself for that. I'm getting close. I didn't even notice. Yes. I believe. I believe. We're getting somewhere. Yes! Come on! You're dead. We did it! 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 And I did it, and I'm, I, I did it. No. No! This can't be happening. You. You. Oh boy. Did he just. You idiot. He. he did he just replenish his health? What the frick? Apparently, he loaded the save file with a. Uh, where he still has the hearts. And I can't move, can I? <laughs> Did you really think you could defeat me? I am the god of this world. Your worthless friend. Can't save you now. Call for help. I dare you. See what good it does you. <gasps> Act! You called for help. I can't get out of there. But nobody came. Boy, what a shame. Nobody else is gonna get to see you die. Well, it's a good run. I knew it. What? How'd you... Where are my powers? <gasps> yeah, powers! The souls? What are they doing? No, no! You're supposed to obey me. Stop it, stop it. Stop. Is that it? Did we defeat him? Oh, sh He wilted. I don't want to mercy him. He had, like, if anyone, I would have mercyed Asgore. I want to fight. You, dude. Kill or be killed in this bitch. I knew you had it in you. Died. I hope you can't do that to any other human that comes down here. I want to slice Flowey's little head off and then pluck every single petal off of it. But I've learned in my heart that forgiveness is the way. I hope he doesn't like take advantage of this, but I'm going to show him mercy. What are you doing? Do you really think I've learned anything from this? That's what I'm hoping for, that he'll learn something. Sparing me won't change anything. Killing me is the only way to end this. But in my heart, I've learned, you bitch. If you let me live, I'll come back. Flowey, come on. I can't understand. Try. I just can't understand. Flowey ran away. It's back to the beginning. It's just a regular flower. Flowey, where did you go? Oh, we're leaving the underground. This is the door. Whoa! That was the game? By Toby Fox. Well, okay, no, it's the end. This is so intense. I'm very sad. They should have had a choice where I could bring Toriel back. I still wonder, like, what would have happened if I was, like, you know, more merciful. I've experienced way too much for just one game. That was insanity. I want to do it again, like six million other different ways. <laughs> that feels so good. I'm done. My phone is ringing. Oh, it sounds. Hey, uh, is anyone there? Since you left, things down here are different. With Asgore gone, Undyne became the ruler of the underground. And since the human souls disappeared, she's also looking for a new way to break the barrier. The queen returned and is now ruling over the underground. Okay. Goat Mama is back in, on the throne. She's instated a new policy. All the humans who fought here will be treated not as enemies, but as friends. Aww. I've been knocking on the door to the ruins. But that woman hasn't been answering me. Oh, I, I should have never killed Toriel. It's haunting me in this game. It's haunting me in my sleep. Hey, at least things are less crowded. Because of all the people you killed, <laughs> hope that was a good experience for you. Just kidding. I don't really hope that. Go to hell. <laughs> Why? Why did you let me go? Since you defeated me. I've been thinking, is killing things really necessary? Get here from the beginning without killing a single thing. 
and I won't kill the king. Then you'll have your so-called happy ending. What if I told you I knew some way to get you a better ending? Why don't you go see Papyrus, then Undyne? It seems like you could have been better friends. Who knows? Maybe she's got the key to your happiness. See you soon. They wanted to give me the pacifist route, huh? So you just beat Undertale. What do you think? That was a good game. That was just demented and psychotic, which is exactly the kind of shit I'm into. Usually I'm not into like, I guess like turn-based games in a sense, but I don't know, like the, just like the, the quirky like comedy. It just had such dumb humor, but it was like, it made it so great. I'm really trying to understand my feelings. Cause I'm like, I really thoroughly enjoyed this game, but I think the ending that I ended up getting just made me feel like unfulfilled just because I feel like such a piece of shit for even killing one creature. This is the first time I've ever played a game from beginning to end and I'm so... To say I'm impressed is an understatement. Completing this game has made me more motivated to complete things in my life in general. I don't know why, but the, the feeling of like completing this is like so satisfying. So what you played through is just one of the three distinct paths okay. through this game. Uh, this path has been known or named by the fans as the neutral path, while the others are called either the true pacifist or genocide. Any idea what those other paths might be like? Well, true pacifist is the guy who just tries to flee from every situation, tries to spare every, every monster that they come in contact with. I feel like the genocide route was probably kill everything in sight. I don't know if that includes even like the wild ones that you would just bump into, but just kill everything. And then that one you would probably end up killing Asgore yourself. Like everyone that in that game, I feel like there's some way that you could probably kill them, but I don't know how. So in a separate bonus episode, we actually have put together a highlight reel of how both of these paths end. Really? Okay. And we're gonna let you watch and react to them. Hell yeah, awesome! Oh, fun! Okay. Then I'll definitely get some sort of closure. Like, even though I didn't get either of those endings, I'll, it'll still feel nice knowing, like, what happened to everyone after I left. Looking back, did you have, like, a most memorable part? I definitely, I definitely liked the, the, the papyrus stuff. Just that, just that whole portion of the game where you're, like, chilling with papyrus and sands and they're, like, cracking jokes. When, when I was going through all the traps through Snowden, that was brilliant. Like, <laughs> I loved that whole time. I feel like a lot of the pairs of enemies, so it was like the twin dogs and the twin, like, guards, both royal guards, I love them too as well. Now they're nice and together. For sure, for sure, is Toriel. Throughout the entire gameplay, you know, you think about what Toriel might be doing, and you know, the game even teases you by having her cell phone number still in your phone. I think it was the killing Toriel, which is super sad, but then also just the overall humor of the game was so memorable, and the cheesiness and the awareness was just mwah. <laughs> what would you say to all the fans who asked that we have you play Undertale? Fans, I have always wanted to play Undertale. I'm happy you guys suggested it. I finally got to play it after two years. I know, I've seen the comments. We finally did it. It was a blast, and I can't thank you more. Thank you for requesting that, because that was, that was, a different game experience for me, and I, I very, I, I enjoyed it. That was probably one of the best game experiences of a, like a campaign style game that I've played through. I'm glad you requested this game because it's, it's. I might turn into a gamer now. I'm like definitely an Undertale fan with you. <laughs> so Undertale released to both critical and commercial success, and was regarded as one of the best games to come out in 2015. However, everything from the music to the design to the story was produced almost entirely by just one person, Toby Fox. That's talent. That's that's a that takes a lot for one person to create a game that still goes on the same way or same trial or whatever, but it has three separate endings somehow. Like you have to spend years doing that. I wonder how long that took, but it paid off, because that's like, it's my, I mean, it's the only game I've ever played, but it's my favorite game. <laughs> Someone who can create a story like that, including the, the, the music, that's, that's a whole nother can of worms to open, you know what I mean? So I gotta I got give massive props to Toby Fox. I'm still just so in awe. Like, I can't believe Undertale had just that much content to it, but yet it went so fast and it was so, like, every second of it was amazing. And I, honestly, it makes me a little bit sad because I would love to experience playing it for the first time all over again. <laughs>
Thanks for watching us play all the way through Undertale. If you don't like mutated flowers, hit the like button. What other games should we play next? Let us know in the comments. You know you have to see those other endings. Make sure to subscribe. See you guys. Hey guys, Mark here, producer at the React channel. Uh, that episode didn't get as gory as it could have. All right, see you in that bonus episode.